let us get straight into the questions question number one a person whose job is to design and modify agricultural equipment as a career as a an engineer b an educator c a manager d a journalist the answer is a an engineer question number two an entomologist is a person who is qualified to work with a insects b soils c plant diseases d medicinal herbs the answer is a insects entomology is the study of insects question number three which of the following can be considered rules of agriculture in the economy of Caribbean tertiaries? 1. Contributing to GDP 2. Reducing the regional food import bill 3. Securing foreign exchange A. 1 and 2 only B. 1 and 3 only C. 2 and 3 only D. 1, 2 and 3 The answer is D. 1, 2 and 3 Three, economic activities involves production, buying and selling activities. Question number four, which of the following aim to produce safe, high quality products in an environmentally responsible way? A, good soil practices. B, good irrigation practices. C, good agricultural practices. D, good pest control practices. The answer is C, good agricultural practices. Question number five, the best term to describe the stealing of agricultural produce is A. Theft B. Pilferage C. Embezzlement D. Predial larceny The answer is D. Predial larceny Question number 6 Which of the following may be the result of global warming? 1. Drought 2. Flooding 3. Dehydration and death of livestock A. 1 only B. 1 and 2 only C, 2 and 3 only. D, 1, 2 and 3. The answer is D, 1, 2 and 3. Global warming is basically the rise in the Earth's temperature and that is normally caused by excess gases such as carbon dioxide that helps to trap the heat on the Earth. Question number 7. Biodiversity refers to the A, sum of all the species in a habitat b origin of all the species in different habitats c size of the species in different habitats d weight of the species in different habitats the answer is a sum of all the species in a habitat biodiversity organic organism those terms mean living things so biodiversity means all the living things that are found in an environment and how they also relate to their habitat an habitat is a natural home for organisms such as the forest and the soil etc question number eight which of the following are characteristics of organic farming one crop rotation is practiced two biopesticides are used three chemical fertilizers improve soil fertility a one and two only b one and three only c two and three only d one two and three the answer is a one and two only bio means living so of course a pesticide made from a living thing can also at times be used on your organic farm question number nine which of the following is not a marketing service a storage b reaping c grading d packaging the answer is b reaping grading is when all the produced that are of same size are put together and what that does is that when you put all the produce that are of the same size together it makes it look more uniform and presentable to the consumer so for example all the eggs of the same size in a tree would look more uniform and appealing more than a tree with large eggs medium eggs and very small eggs question number 10 which of the following may be determined by the availability of capital on the farm one the size of the land to be cultivated. 2. The markets at which the produce is to be sold. 3. The type of commodity to be produced. A. 1 and 2 only. B. 1 and 3 only. C. 2 and 3 only. D. 1, 2 and 3. The answer is A. 1 and 2 only. Examples of the capital on the farm could be your machines and equipment. The amount of machines 
and a farm would definitely affect the size land that is cultivated as well as the type of market because the more you you will be able to produce with machines the larger the markets you can supply if you are not able to produce a lot then you would have to supply a smaller market question number 11 item 11 refers to the following diagram the graph above most likely represents the a law of supply b law of demand c food conversion ratio d law of diminishing returns the answer is d law of diminishing returns question number 12 the point at which a demand curve intersects a supply curve indicates the a selling price b break even point c equilibrium point d point of profit maximization the answer is c equilibrium point equilibrium point is basically showing you or explaining that in the market there is no undersupply of goods or oversupply of goods the buyer and the seller they are happy with the price that the goods are sold for question number 13 the cost of using money borrowed from an agricultural bank is known as a loan b interest c finance d capital the answer is b interest so for example you borrow ten thousand dollars the bank will give you the ten thousand dollars however when you're going to repay that loan you might pay a total of twelve thousand dollars now the two thousand dollars is the interest and that is the pay to the bank we're so actually paying the bank to borrow their money question number 14 to increase coffee production the government provides incentives through land preparation and planting material this incentive is known as a subsidy b reward c credit d tax the answer is a subsidy the government normally provides three main types of incentives those would be subsidy price support and tax breaks question number 15 in which of the following ways can a cooperative benefit a farmer one reduce interest rates at commercial banks two reduce cost of inputs three better bargaining power with the government a one and two only b one and three only c two and three only d one two and three the best answer from the list is c two and three only of course the cooperative don't have the power to reduce the cost of inputs but from the list when they bargain with the government the government may can offer incentives so to some extent in that way indirectly they may can affect the cost of input but from these items the best answer is c question number 16 a dairy farmer has 100 heads of cattle and wants a loan to add 50 more heads he should prepare a a cash flow statement b a partial budget c a complete budget d an income statement the answer is b a partial budget a partial budget is normally done from a complete budget so when you have a change in one or some of the items you would just do a partial budget so in the example above the farmer has a whole farm an established farm already which would mean an established budget already however he just wanted to, to add some more cattle so he just do the budget of just the 50 not a total of 150 so he'd have a budget of 100 cattle already however he would just do the budget of just that extra 50 he wouldn't go and do back another budget with 150 he just do the, the 50 and then he can add it to the 100 if he likes question number 17 the major function of the agricultural section of the caribbean development bank is to a disburse loans to caribbean governments for agriculture development projects b advise government and agriculture development projects c give financial help to regional extension services d give loans to individual farmers for agriculture the answer is a disburse loans to caribbean governments for agricultural development projects question number 18 item 18 refers to the following information the yield and average price per kilogram of four crops are given in the table below based on the gross return only which is the most profitable crop for the farmer to plant a cabbage b cauliflower c lettuce d tomato the answer is b cauliflower question number 19 the weight of a porker pig is 70 kg the dressing percentage is 60 percent and the market price of the meat is four dollars per pound 
The farmer's income from the sale of pork from the pig is A. $112 B. $168 C. $240 D. $280 The answer is B. $168 but What the question is saying is that 60% of the 70 pound of pig would be sold so it is telling you that 60% of the pig would be sold as meat the other 40 would be waste so like the other 40 would be the tripe or the parts that they don't want so in finding the 60% of the pig that would be sold you would divide 60 by 100 times 70 that will give you 42 kilogram of pig now 42 kilograms of pig would be sold of meat would be sold so you times that times four dollars per kilogram you get the 168 question number 20 a complete budget is prepared a after selling produce b before claiming subsidies c before starting an enterprise d when adding a new enterprise the answer is c before starting an enterprise now the budget is a financial plan so it's a plan that is made before the business has started now you can make a plan but you know you might not be able to carry out the plan but of course you still do the budget so a budget is a plan it's done before you actually start the enterprise or the business question number 21 unless soil conservation measures are continually practiced the caribbean will grow more dependent on foreign countries for food the problem referred to here is mostly one of a erosion b finance c flooding d land use the answer is a erosion question number 22 which of the following characteristics is are true for clay soils one low water retention two poor aeration three high capillarity a one only b three only c two and three only d one two and three the answer is c two and three only of course clay has poor aeration and of course it has high capillarity now capillarity is when water moves up in the soil question number 23 what is the function of bacteria in the carbon cycle a combustion of fossil fuels b assisting with photosynthesis c release of oxygen into the air d decomposition of organic matter the answer is D, decomposition of organic matter. So during the carbon cycle, what happened? Carbon is taken from the atmosphere via plants. Now the plants use the carbon to make food via photosynthesis. Now the carbon would eventually become a part of the plants. Now when those plants are dead, the bacteria will decompose those plant parts, thus releasing back those carbon into the atmosphere. Hence a cycle. Question number 24. A farmer tested the pH of garden soil and found it to be 5. To increase the pH of this soil, she should add A. Urea B. Ferrous sulfate C. Calcium carbonate D. Ammonium sulfate The answer is C. Calcium carbonate. Now a 5 on the pH scale is basically telling you that the soil is acidic. To go up on the scale, it means you want your soil to be alkalinic. So you would add calcium carbonate to make it alkaline now remember if you add fertilizers to your soil you will make it more acidic so you would not add any of the fertilizers to your soil so you are a ferrous sulfate ammonium sulfate those are fertilizers calcium carbonate is white lime or whitewash question number 25 item 25 refers to the following histogram which shows the rainfall for a country in the caribbean the ice incidence of fungal diseases will most likely be in the months of a january february and october b february march and october c may june and december d september october and november the answer is c may june and december the incidence of fungal diseases will increase when there is more rain question number 26 burning as a form of land clearing is not advisable because it a leaves the soil black b breaks down soil texture c increases atmospheric temperature d removes valuable nutrients from the soil the answer is b break down soil texture when you burn the soil of course the organic matter will be destroyed when the organic component of soil is destroyed then the texture of the soil will be greatly affected 
Question number 27. Item 27 refers to the following diagram which shows a piece of equipment often used by small farmers. Why there is a small opening at point X. A. To allow it to act as an overflow outlet. B. To enable air to be drawn inside the cylinder. C. To enable the operator to see inside the cylinder. D. Because the operator failed to screw on the cap. The answer is B. To enable air to be drawn inside the cylinder. So the diagram here is a sprayer and of course X is pointing on the pump of the sprayer. Now the purpose of the pump is to put air inside the sprayer. So of course it can build up pressure to spray out the liquid. Question number 28. Which of the following structures regulates water lost in a leaf? A. Cuticle. B. Guard cells. C. Epithelial cells. D. Mesophyll cells. The answer is B. Guard cells. Question number 29. The requirements for the manufacture of food in plants are A. Oxygen, water, sunlight, soil. B. Oxygen, water, sunlight, chlorophyll. C. Carbon dioxide, water, sunlight, soil. D. Carbon dioxide, water, sunlight, chlorophyll. The answer is D. Carbon dioxide, water, sunlight, chlorophyll. Question number 30. Crop rotation is a method of protecting the soil and replenishing its nutrients by planting A. Crops following the contour around a slope B. A succession of different crops on the same land C. A single crop on the same area of land each time after herbicides are being applied D. Crops in an area where the fertilizer has been applied in a circular manner the answer is B, a succession of different crops on the same land. So different type of crop would be based on the, the parts that you eat for food. So if for example a leaf crop like Kalaloo, then you would not plant back a leaf crop on that piece of um, area of land. You'd plant back maybe a fruit crop or a root crop. Question number 31, food produced during photosynthesis moves from the leaves to other parts of the plants by a process called a. Absorption. B. Respiration. C. Translocation. D. Transpiration. The answer is C. Translocation. Any movement of substances within a plant is referred to as translocation. Question number 32. Which of the following plants cannot be propagated by either grafting or budding? A. Mango. B. Banana. C. Grapefruit. D. Avocado. Pear. The answer is B. Banana. Of course, banana is commonly propagated by removing a sucker or tissue culture. Question number 33. Which of the following are characteristics of weeds? 1. Reduced crop yield. 2. Lower crop quality. 3. Increased nutrients for crops. A. 1 and 2 only. B. 1 and 3 only. C. 2 and 3 only. D. 1, 2 and 3. The answer is A. 1 and 2 only. Question number 34. If tallest capital T is dominant to shortness, common T, what will be the possible genotype of the offspring of a homozygous dominant times a homozygous recessive cross? A. All dominant. B. All heterozygous. C. Off dominant and off recessive. D. Off recessive and off heterozygous. The answer is B. All heterozygous. Question number 35. Which of the following is not a mulching material spread on the soil in order to lessen the evaporation of water a straw b fertilizer c compost d dried leaf the answer is b fertilizer question number 36 you observe round spots which turn brown on the citrus leaves in the school orchard the leaves then fall off the most likely disease affecting the plant is a leaf spot b root rot c anthracnose d sutimol the answer is a leaf spot Question number 37. Item 37 refers to a situation where a field of cabbage shows sign of a heavy attack by a larva of the cabbage white butterfly. Which of the following symptoms are the plants most likely to show? A. Entire leaf veins eaten. B. Root system destroyed. C. Leaf yellow and plants stunted. D. Severe damage to leaves and head. The answer is D. Severe damage to leaves and heads. The larva will be able to eat the leaves, but they will not be able to eat the veins of the leaves, or all the veins of the leaves. Question number 38. Which of the following instructions for harvesting are appropriate? 1. Tomatoes. Piquant fruits are dark green in color. 2. Beans. 
pick when pads will snap clean when broken. 3. Cabbage, uproot from the ground. 4. Sweet potato, dig when leaves begin to dry, avoid bruising and do not break roots. A. 1 and 2 only B. 1 and 3 only C. 2 and 3 only D. 2 and 4 only. The answer is D. 2 and 4 only. Question number 39. Post harvest losses are least likely to occur in the process of A. Storing B. Labeling C. Packaging D. Transporting. The answer is B. Labeling. Question number 40. Which of the following are advantages of processing? 1. Allows the farmer to maximize profits. 2. Reduces the incidence of post-harvest diseases. 3. Prolong the storage life of the produce. A. 1 and 2 only. B. 1 and 3 only. C. 2 and 3 only. D. 1, 2 and 3. The answer is D. 1, 2 and 3. Question number 41. In the digestive system of a bird, which part stores food immediately after swallowing? A. Crop. B. Gizzard. C. Proventriculus. D. Small intestine. The answer is A. Crop. Question number 42. Cellulose digestion in sheep starts in the A. Abomasum. B. Reticulum. C. Omasum. D. Rumen. The answer is D. Rumen. Question number 43. Item 43 refers to the following information. A farmer's record shows that the average live weight of 100 birds is 2 kg, while the feed consumed by all the birds is 800 kg. What is the feed conversion ratio of the birds? A. 4 to 1 B. 8 to 1 C. 8 to 4 D. 12 to 1 The answer is A. 4 to 1 The formula for feed conversion is the total amount of feed consumed over the total body weight of the birds or of the animals. So in this case, we would find the total weight by multiplying the 100 times the 2. So 2 times 100 would give you 200 pounds of bird so you would put 800 divided by 200 so 200 in, into itself 1 200 into 804 so it's a 4 to 1 ratio. question number 44 a poultry farmer adds double the recommended dosage of antibiotics to the drinking water of his broilers he is advised that this practice is wrong mainly because it may a endanger the farm workers b Reduce the growth rate of the broilers. C. Endanger the health of his consumers. D. Lead to a low mortality rate of his birds. The answer is C. Endanger the health issue of his consumers. Question number 45. Which of the following groups of feedstuff supplies animals with mainly carbohydrates? A. Soya bean, acacia, kudzu, gliricidia. B. Fish meal, bagasse, rice bran, corn. C. Coconut meal, coconut meal. Cocoa meal, fish meal, citrus meal. D. Broken rice, wheat meddling, brewer's grain, molasses. The answer is D. Broken rice, wheat meddling, brewer's grain, and molasses. Question number 46. The term Barbados black belly refers to A. A disease fatal to cattle. B. A type of fish found in Barbados. C. The name of a regional breed of sheep. D. The beetle which destroys sweet potato tuber. The answer is C, the name of a regional breed of sheep. Question number 47. Which type of equipment is used to lift out frames from the super in a hive? A, smoker. B, hive tool. C, B net. D, decapping knife. The answer is B, hive tool. Question number 48. During the process of egg formation in poultry, the shell is formed in the A, uterus. B, isthmus. C, magnum. D. Infundibulum. The answer is A. Uterus. Question number 49. Litter is spread on the floor space of a poultry pen mainly to A. Provide warmth. B. Prevent pecking. C. Absorb droppings. D. Supply extra feed. The answer is C. Absorb droppings. Common litter is the sawdust or the rice hull. Question number 50. The queen excluder prevents the queen from A. Escaping the hive. B. Mating with the drone. C. Interacting with the workers. D. Laying eggs in the honey super. The answer is D. Laying eggs in the honey super. The queen excluder is basically a mesh, and that mesh prevents the queen from going through. Only the workers can go through that mesh. So, what happened during the honey season? That queen excluder is placed in the hive, and what it will do is to prevent the queen from going in the honey super to lay eggs. Which of the following is a true layer breed of poultry? A. Shaver. B. Peterson. C. White Leghorn. D. Vantress Cross. The answer is C. White Leghorn. 
Question number 52. An animal in heat is A. Ready to be mated B. In need of water C. Suffering from fever D. Under severe heat stress The answer is A. Ready to be mated Now when an animal is in heat, it means that the animal is ovulating The animal, normally the, the females come in heat So it means the females are ovulating, meaning they are releasing eggs When they release an egg, they would need sperm to fertilize that egg So they would be open for mating question number 53 the beaking of chickens is done to prevent a eating of litter b spillage of feed c pecking one another d attacking the farmer the answer is c pecking one another question number 54 item 54 refers to the following information a poultry farmer allows 50 LTNs to run on his farm with one mature rooster he feeds the birds with a balanced ration and they produce a very large number of eggs. The eggs are incubated at an average temperature of 38 degrees Celsius. But after 21 days, only 20% of the eggs hatch. Which of the following best explain why only 20% of the eggs hatched? A. All the eggs are not fertilized by the rooster. B. All eggs do not hatch at the same temperature. C. The incubator is too large for the number of eggs. D. The incubation temperature is not appropriate. The answer is A. All the eggs are not fertilized by the rooster. The rooster could not be able to mate it with so many hens. So the farmer actually need more roosters to service those hens. For every 12 hens, there is one rooster needed. Question number 55. Artificial insemination has become increasingly popular in the Caribbean in recent years because A. It ensures that conception takes place. B. Fewer trained technicians are now available. C. It is a less costly way to upgrade local animals. D. Regional governments have been expanding the service. The answer is C. It is a less costly way to upgrade the local animals. Question number 56. A farmer who is mating is Flemish giant females to New Zealand white. Males is rearing A. Goats. B. Rabbits. C. Sheep. D. Cattle. The answer is B. Rabbits. Question number 57. Farmer Keith observed that is cause add the following symptoms 1 a dull rough coat 2 an offensive body odor c excessive salivating the farmer concluded that the animals were a sick b healthy c restless d in eat the answer is a sick question number 58 which of the following organisms causes coccidiosis a fungus b bacterium c protozoan d microplasma the answer is c protozoan now remember the coccidiosis is a common disease that affects both poultry and rabbits. Question number 59. Which of the following is not a benefit of pasteurization of milk? A. Improvement of milk composition. B. Destruction of harmful bacteria. C. Maintenance of nutritive value. D. Improvement of flavor and taste. The answer is C. Maintenance of nutritive value. When pasteurization is done, a lot of heat is added and the heat destroys some of the nutrients in the milk. Question number 60. The live weight of a goat is 50 kg. The dress carcass weight is 30 kg. What is the dressing percentage? A. 30. B. 40. C. 50. D. 60. The answer is D. 60. The formula for dressing percentage is the dress weight over the live weight times 100. So, it is the 30 over the 50 times 100. So 100 divided by 50 is 2. 2 times 30 is 60. 